guys. Happy Wednesday. Hope everyone had a good day yesterday. A good afternoon on Monday. And I hope you're going to have a wonderful day today. Um, so, last week. So this today, yes, on Monday, we sang a whole bunch of songs that were all about outside and things like that. And we read a book about zero. Today we're going to read a whole bunch of, we're going to sing a whole bunch of songs that are pretty songs. Um, and some peaceful, really peaceful songs. Then we'll read a book about, that has a relation to the book zero. Mm, I wonder what it could be. Start thinking. So, let's get started. And so all our songs today, we have a bunch of songs, will be nice, pretty songs. All right. I think. <laughs> we'll see. All right. I think I got it set up that way. So let's start with Rainbow Rainbow by Mother Goose Club. video. All right, let's see. Our next song is Somewhere Over the Rainbow by Yip Harburg. Thank you. 
pretty song. Ooh, my fingers got a little. I don't know if you've ever noticed through all these 10 weeks of uh, YouTube videos that um, when I get really high, my voice gets really shaky. Okay. It's about how people, some people are sopranos when they sing, and those are, those are people who can sing. And then you have your altos, like me, things like that. All right, let's do We Are Drops. So I sing, you sing, I sing, you sing. And then we have that one part, the chorus, where we sing together. We are drops. We are drops of one ocean. We are waves of one sea. Come and join us together in our quest for unity. It's a way of life for you and me. We are flowers. Have one garden. We are with leaves of one tree. Come and join us in our quest for unity. It's a way of life for you and me. All right, let's do so, so powerful. Good, so we need our hands, right? So, so powerful, so, so powerful is the light of unity. So, so powerful, so, so powerful is the light of unity that it can illuminate the whole earth. That it can illuminate the whole earth, the whole Get your hands going. All right. Ooh, this is always a good one. Magic Penny by Melvina Reynolds. I do really, really love this one. couple songs a little slower and let's sing light a candle for peace by Shelly Murley so remember I don't know if we if you remember but our fingers light a candle for peace light a candle for love light a candle that shines all the way around the world Light a candle for me, light a candle for you, that our wish for world peace 
will one day come true. Sing peace around the world. 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 That's the hand motions, okay? Light a candle for peace. Light a candle for love. Light a candle that shines all the way around the world. Light a candle for me. Light a candle for you. That I wish for world peace will one day come true. a candle for peace, light a candle for love, light a candle that shines all the way around the world, light a candle for me, light a candle for you, that I wish for world peace will one day come true. That's also a very pretty song. Very important song, too. Okay. Well, let's sing What a Wonderful World. See if I can do it today. I see trees of green, red roses, too. I see them bloom for me and you. And I think Yes, I think to myself, what a wonderful world. What a wonderful world it is indeed. I think our world is quite wonderful. Okay, let's do the I'd Like to Teach the World to Sing by the New Seekers. Sometimes I have a tricky time with this. My fingers are starting to tingle. <laughs> and like to build a world a home and find relationship with love. Grow up with trees and honeybees and snow white turtle doves. And like to teach the world to sing in perfect harmony.
this is always a fun one. All right, two more songs, you guys. This is This Land is Your Land. Remember the book we read that one time? The beautiful, but we're not gonna sing all those verses. We're just gonna have a chorus and two verses. Because um, when we start singing songs together, sometimes having all those, it'd be nice to have the book. I'm not gonna have the book of my ukulele. And uh, so, I mean, the course is the fun part now, right? All right, this land is your land. This land is your land, this land is my land. From California to the New York Islands, from the Redwood Forest to the Gulf Stream waters. This land is made for you and me. As I was walking that ribbon of highway, I saw above me the endless skyway. I saw below. for today you guys baby beluga baby beluga in the deep blue sea swim so wild and you swim so free heaven above and the sea below and the little white whale on the go how cute you are all right who there's a lot of songs but that was a lot of fun all right are you ready for this book so remember monday we read a book called zero by katherine otoshi right today you figure out what it is any ideas none you're not sure monday's was called zero today the book is called one <laughs> One by Catherine Otoshi.
blue was a quiet color. He enjoyed looking up at the sky, floating on the waves, and on days he felt daring, splashing in rain puddles. Every once in a while, he wished he could be more sunny like yellow or bright like green, more regal like purple or outgoing like orange, but overall, being blue, except when he was with red. Red was a hothead. He liked to pick on blue. Red is a great color, he'd say. Red is hot. Blue is not. Then blue would feel bad about being blue. That's so sad. That's not very nice. Sometimes yellow comforted blue. Blue is a very nice color, she'd say. But yellow never said that in front of red. She never said, stop picking on blue. Green, purple, and orange thought blue was nice too, but they never told red to stop either. Every time red said something mean, and no one spoke up. He got bigger and bigger and bigger. Soon Red grew so big that everyone was afraid of him. No one dared to stop him. Red picked on all the colors and then everyone felt Little blue. Poor colors. Until one came. He had a different shape with bold strokes and squared corners. It was funny. He made the colors laugh. Red saw this and got very hot. Stop laughing, he told yellow. Stop laughing, he told green. Stop laughing, he told purple and orange. And they did. Red rolled up to one. Stop laughing, he told him. But one stood straight up like an arrow and said, no. Red was mad, but one would not budge. So Red rolled away. One turned to the colors and said, if someone is mean and picks on me, I, for one, stand up and say no. Good lesson. Then Yellow felt brave and said, me, Two. Green agreed and said, me three. And the purple said, me four. And orange became me five. Blue saw the colors change. He wanted to count. Red grew hot. He left, felt left out. He grew hotter and hotter and hotter. Red raced over to Blue and said what he always did. Red is hot. Blue is not. But this time, Blue stood up tall and became six. Red can be red can be really hot, he said, but blue can be super cool. Red blew a fuse and tried to roll over blue.
But everyone took a stand and said, no! Seeing them stand tall made Red feel very, very, very small. Then Red turned even redder and began rolling away. Lou called out, can red be hot and blue be cool? Red stopped in his tracks. Red can count two, said one. That's nice, I like that. Red rocked and rolled and turned into Seven! Everyone counts, they shouted. Then Red laughed and joined the fun. Sometimes it just takes one. Sometimes it just takes one person to stand up to someone hurting other people, being mean to other people. Everyone is important. Everyone counts. I hope you enjoyed all our songs today and our book one. And I will see you Friday for the last YouTube. Can't believe it's been 10 weeks. Has it been 10 weeks or more weeks? I don't even know anymore. Um, but it's time to get outside and play more and more than staying inside watching me. So you can always watch my old videos and things like that. So Friday. We're going to have some fun songs. We're going to watch Maddie do some dancing so you can dance along with her. And we'll read one last story. All right. Have a great day today and day tomorrow. And I'll see you Friday. Bye.